Barakatha Yahweh, Barakatha Yahweh Shai, Barakatha Yahweh, Barakatha Yahweh Shai, Barakatha Yahweh, Bahasham Yahweh Shai, Wa Baha Racha Kodash, double honor to the elder apostles of the Great Millstone. Citations to the Akim pushing this gospel, this good news, the world over. Adwan Rathazar, which means Lord willing, and also Lord willing, this lesson is edifying. And uh, yeah, welcome to another update of the digital all. Alright, the digital all, which is the RFID micro CHIP technology. Okay, and uh, yep, this is an update. As you can see, I've got this article. Alright, inspiration is drawn from this article for this lesson from the source of Reuters, which is a reliable, you know, very reliable uh, news source. Okay, and this was uh, dated on the April 8th of April 2024, the hopefully of Jacob's trouble. Okay, and it says a uh, exclusive synchron arrival to Musk's Neuralink Redis large scale brain implant trial. Okay, so we've seen <clears throat> this becoming more and more common. Okay, as they've tested this on monkeys, they've, they've had people volunteer. We had that individual, that 29 year old individual who was paralyzed from an accident. I believe it was a diving accident, if I remember correctly, and was able to play, you know, games with his mind, you know, like Mario Kart. Was it chess, you know? So we're super, very, very close to the end, man. Okay, because they're just telling you outright. All right. Synchron Inc. arrival to Elon Musk's Neuralink brain implant startup is preparing to recruit patients for a large-scale clinical trial required to seek commercial approval for its device. The company's chief executive, Toy Reuters, Synchron on Monday plans to launch an online registry for patients interested in joining the trial meant to include dozens of participants and has received interest from from about 120 clinical trial centers to help run the study, CEO Thomas Oxley said in an interview. Part of this registry is to start to enable local physicians to speak to patients with motor impairment, he said. There's a lot of interest, so we, do, sorry, so we don't want it to come in a big bottleneck right before the study we'll be doing. New York-based Synchron is farther along in the process of testing its brain implant than Neuralink. Both companies initially aimed to help paralyzed patients type on computer using devices that interpret brain signals. So this is, you know, the left-hand miracles of, of E. Okay. And we know what scripture says about receiving this physical device. All right, you know, grievous sore and, and things like that. Upon those who took the mark. All right. So, you know, these different Edomite, you know, companies are, you know, going to rival you know to have this so this is how the devil puts it out in front of you you know the choice of, of, of illusion all right pick your poison basically just like you had with the different vaccines the johnson and john johnson the astrazeneca uh maxine the P F I Z E R. if i'm spelling that correctly one as well all right things like that okay so he's you know Advertising it in a in a very um sedu seductive way, okay. You know, pick your poison type thing. So Synchron received U.S. authorization from pre preliminary testing in July 2021, and has implanted its device in six patients. There goes the number six again. All right, prior testing in four patients in Australia showed no serious adverse side effects. The company has reported. All right. We know six 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 going into the, you know, <laughs> the number of his name, the mark of the beast. You know, Revelation thirteen on down, Re Revelation thirteen verse sixteen on down rather. Okay, which we'll get later. All right. Synchron will be analyzing the U.S. data to prepare for the larger study while awaiting authorization from the U.S. FDA to proceed. That's what Oxley said. Synchron and the FDA declined to comment on the expecting expecting timing of that decision. Okay. Yeah, so we're here, man. The company aims to include patients who are paralyzed due to the neurodegenerative disease, ALS, right? Stroke and multiple sclerosis, MS, all right? Mount Sinai in New York, the University of Buffalo Neurosurgery and the University of Pittsburgh Medical Center are collaborating on the preliminary study. Synchron said it hopes to involve these centers in the larger trial. Okay, so 
notice how this technology came out of Babylon the Great, man. So they're pushing full force with this. Right. So yeah. If we go further down, it's quite a lot to this article. But you know, decent information. Right. Expanding the market subheading. Synchron, whose investors include billionaires, Jeff Bezos and you know who, and Neuralink compete in a niche of so-called brain computer interface devices, BCI. Such devices use electrodes that penetrate the brain or sit on its surface to provide direct communication to computers. No company has received the final FDA approval to market a BCI brain implant. Okay. <laughs> okay, so. You know, this, this is all about prophecy. All right. We'll basically, you know, get a few scriptures. All right. Bear with me. Let's go to the book of Colossians, chapter 4, and verse 5. And it reads, Walk in wisdom toward them that are without, redeeming the time. All right. That's right, man. Walk in wisdom toward them that are without, redeeming the time. You know, and, <laughs> and most of our people, especially the 2000 Babylon the Great, you know, you so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans were the true biblical Hebrew Israelites, and Israelite foreigners as well. You know, the speckled bird. All right. Two thirds in Babylon the Great, man. Then they're, they're not walking in wisdom. All right. They're not redeeming the time, as well as you know Israelite rebels elsewhere in the world. They're not doing that at all. Just like these heathens in in the world as well. Okay. And we're at the point now that if you do not see that this MOTB is what the Bible is talking about then you're not going to see it. And if you're not going to see it, then you may end up, you know, you may wind up taking it, taking a device. Okay. Because when this becomes mandated globally, right, there's going to be a lot of uprising. People are already in uproar right now. Okay. There's going to be rebel groups that are not going to be down with this. Just like there were people that were not down with taking the vaccine. Okay. Things like that. People being thrown into FEMA camps. Okay. <laughs> so, you know, it's going to be a dangerous times, man. Okay. You know, and a lot of people will be lining up to take the sea hip. There's going to be a lot of division, a lot of physical violence. Okay. Division even within the family, friends. All right. And like I said, you know, a lot of people are going to be lining up to take this too. Okay, fighting each other, who can get it first, as well, alright, let's get the book of 2 Corinthians, chapter 2, and verse 11, we'll get this in another translation, Second Corinthians chapter two verse eleven in the Amplified Version to keep Satan from taking advantage of us who are not ignorant of his schemes. That's right, man. This devil E, you know, he's putting it in your face, man. He's basically advertising it. E, right, displays this as a trendy, cool piece of technology, the latest thing going. And when I when I say E, I'm talking about the the physical counterparts, the spiritual demon Satan, all right, the you know the Caucasian race, all right. So yeah, they, they show you their agenda in their media, their films, TV shows, cartoons, alright? Some things they make hidden in plain sight, alright? But you have to have that spiritual eye, right, to see it. You have to have your spiritual eyes open, man. Alright? That's why we're not ignorant to, to his devices. You see? <laughs> you know, and this devil's gonna, you know... Play on the, on the mind, especially the young ones who are in, you know, especially the young ones, the younger target audience when it comes to like video games, all right, and things like that, because that's what's you know cool and trendy, you know, virtual reality things like that, all right. So he's, he's gonna market it, 
you know, in a very um, persuasive manner. Okay. Especially in, in, in the gaming world. All right. Okay. But, you know, we're not ignorant, man. We know what we're doing. So we know what they're doing, all right, and what they're up to. Okay. You know, putting it in your face. Because we don't have much time left, man. E will soon be rooted out of power for good. All right. See, they, they bring news articles out more and more frequently now regarding this. You see, regarding the grain of rice, all right, F promoting it to you, all right, promote it to the masses. They want the masses of the people, right, to be surgically implanted with this CHIP, albeit whether it's in your hand or in your brain, right, you know, as it states in the book of Revelation, chapter 13, verse 16 on down. So this is, you know, Bible prophecy, man. Revelation, chapter 13, verse 16. And he causeth all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive a mark in their right hand or in their foreheads, and that no man might buy or sell, save he that had the mark, or the name of the beast, or the number of his name. Here is wisdom, let him that hath understanding count the number of the beast, for it is the number of a man, and his number is six hundred three score and six. That's alright. See? You know, they tend to push six a lot. Okay. See ya? So... Pray this lesson was edifying. Gonna end it there. In closing, call halal Yahweh Bashim Shai. Peace, blessings, and mercy to the Bayat Shah Dabadar, the house of David. Kwam Yashurala. Wa Babukasha, Babukasha, Babukasha. Destroy America. Mawatha Babal. Shabbat Shalom to the elect.